Hi, I'm Carmen DeVito, garden designer here in New York City and co-host of the Weedic Plants podcast on the Heritage Radio Network. I'm here in my Brooklyn garden and today we're going to talk about growing herbs, my four favorite herbs, parsley, sage, rosemary, and thyme that you can grow indoors or out. I'm here in my garden um, in Brooklyn. I grow a lot of herbs here, both in pots and in the ground. Um, this is lemon balm, which is great to grow in a container or in the ground. This is whorehound, which is an herb that was used a lot for sore throats and, and as a medicinal. It's one of the bitterest <laughs> herbs known to man. And now I'm going to show you in the ground parsley. Parsley, um, in my garden, comes back every year, but I also like to replant it regularly and it's a fantastic herb to attract pollinators such as butterflies. I get a lot of black swallowtail butterflies in my garden. So easy to grow. Okay, so the four herbs we're going to talk about today are parsley, sage, culinary sage, rosemary, this is a beautiful big rosemary, and thyme. These are the four herbs that I use the most and I'm going to show you how to repot them. Um, I like to use clay and one of the tricks um, for growing in containers is you can put um, a piece of landscape fabric which is a weed barrier you can find it in rolls and I like to put a circle a piece that covers the bottom of the pot like this and it prevents the soil from coming out and then um, um, I like to use a, a rich soil, but that's very free draining. This is a combination of compost and a lightweight soil. So I fill the container and I press it down like this. And then I gently take the plant out of its container. This one's pretty pot bound. You can see the roots. So a good thing to do is just kind of squeeze it out and it should pop out like that. And then I gently, very, very gently loosen up and tease the root system so that it starts stimulating growth after I repot it. Then I want to plant it at the same depth, not bury it too deep or not uh, plant it too high. So I plant it in there at about the same level. And then I gently fill in around like that, pressing in to get rid of any air pockets that might develop. And then I gently tap it to kind of level it out. And then I water it with a gentle kind of rain. <laughs> supposed to come out gently. <laughs> and let it drain. Okay, the final step and a little trick that I like to do to keep my herbs clean is I like to top dress them with a little bit of gravel, which you can get in any home store. This is just called pea gravel. And the reason I like to use it is because when I water my plants, dirt doesn't splash up. And if you have plants outside, um, it doesn't, when it rains, it doesn't splash the dirt onto the plants and your herbs stay kind of clean. And I think it also just looks a lot prettier that way. So just pea gravel or you can use sand and especially herbs like thyme and rosemary that like to stay on the drier side, it helps them to grow better and have less issues. Thanks for watching my video about herb gardening. My name is Carmen DeVito. You can follow me on Instagram at goodydevito66.